Snake Man here, Frog Tide. Look at them. Ten little froggies. Green tree frogs. Spiffo, eh? Now, we use these in our reptile show. And the reason we have ten, when we are at a school or another venue, every child can hold an animal. We are the only hands-on hold the animals people. Okay, now, let's get to it. This is an arm or a leg from a mouse. Frog. All of them will eat. Watch. Biddy, aim, fat frog always eats. Yes, Jenny Craig, here we come. Next one. We have frog two. Here we go. It. That's two down. Now we have frog three. Uh, frog three. Uh, frog three, knock back. Frog three. And that's three down. Here we go. Frog four. Here you go, frog four. Now, if you have fart on these frogs, they turn purple. Right, so we've got about four, I think we're up to. Lost count, might be five. Anyway, hope the person watching the video knows. Here you go, frog. Yeah. That one ate. That's the one that knocked it back before. He's got it. All right, he's done. You can see he's down there. He's eating it. All right, now. Here we go. Next one. Is this one being fed? Can't keep counting. Here we go. Froggy. Uh, yeah, uh, no, Mr. Idiot Frog. Oh, no, he got it. Right. It's about five or six, so we did it. Okay, next. Another one. And these have got roughage and everything. I was feeding him smoked salmon last week. Bits of smoked salmon. I didn't have anything handy. I had to feed him in a hurry. Here we go. Another one down. Okay. Good thing about these, they're very similar to insects. They've got roughage and shit in them, so... Excuse me, the shit is a technical term for hair. Now, come on, frog, I think you're the last one. Eat. Right, now, I think they've all eaten. Oh, no, we've got one over here, I forgot. <laughs> right, poor frog, forgot him here. Eat. There. <laughs> Idiot frog here. Food. Got it. Right, that was easy, wasn't it? Right, okay, now, I think that's it. Oh, I'll just grab this in case anyone wants seconds. Okay. Did you eat? Don't know if this one ate or not. I think he has. Hey. Come back to him. <laughs> Horrible things. Go on, eat. I think I fit more wheat, eh? <laughs> right, okay. Now I think that, that one I can't remember if that one ate or not. And they'll say that after a while, don't they? A very racist comment really, could you imagine? You say they all green tree frogs look the same, it's such a racist comment. Could you imagine you say that about people? Yeah. There was this, it's funny actually how you can always say jokes about your own kind without getting in trouble. There's this Asian comedian who was cracking all these racist Asian jokes the other day on the radio and of course you can't call him racist because he was Asian. But I mean, it's so funny. He, that's just how it is. Me, I crack racist jokes but I'm not racist. Not in a bad way anyway. I'm only racist in a good way. That is, I tell my kids to be Asian, which means be intelligent. Go! Beautiful. Thank you. Now, I think we've done it all. That. One, two, three, four. Tell me about this one. Did you eat? <laughs> Looks fat. <laughs> it's like biggest loser. I think that one ate too much smoked salmon last week. Mate, it was like feeding steroids when you feed them smoked salmon. It's pretty full on. Anyway, here. Steroid frog, yeah. Right, look, fat poo, he ate it. Right, so they've definitely all eaten now. We might have got two lots. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there's one underneath eight. How about you? See? Gold it up. Might even have a second one. God, that water's freezing. I don't know how you can tolerate it. <laughs> Tropical frogs, they're in, a heat, they're in a heated room and they got cold water. What's happened? Anyway, yeah, you've got to keep warm because fungus kills these stupid things. Uh, these things, this is a small breed. This is a dwarf phase of green tree frog. Oh, still going. with a feral. I don't know. I don't know which one you are. They still eat. See, normally they'd eat one each and give up, but I haven't fed them since Friday last week. So, and that, but that was smoked salmon. That really, like, pumped them up, but one of them spewed it up because, oh, I don't know, I fed it, and then we took them, sent them straight out the same day, and probably got half squashed by some feral child. Anyway, that's what happens. They take a beating, but I mean these frogs they'll thrive and never they never die on us. They Oh, by the way, you got all our enemies always tell us that we're cruel and evil and all this sort of crap. Just complete lies of course. 
and they say, oh, you handled them with dry hands. Now, this is in a cage. You can see I just picked the cage up, brought it in here to, for the video. This rock is dry. See, dry. So I'll get a bit of water, splashy, splashy, wet there, dry. Dry frogs, dry rock. Dry, dry. Fish live in water. Frogs live on land. They are meant to be dry. Bit slimy. If they stay like that forever, they'll shrivel up, but not when you're handling them for 10 minutes or something. It's fine. We send them out in the morning in a dry container. We bring them home in the evening in a dry container. When I get home, I throw them in the water. They just soak it up like a sponge, and they are fine. And they thrive. That's all for now from the Snake Man.